hey guys what's up everybody welcome to my youtube channel today i'll be showing you guys how i did this glamorous makeup look it's so easy and effortless that i even surprised myself so here i am all barefaced ready to rock and roll but first for a living now to survive so we're working from within first off skincare this is actually a dietary supplement that I've been taking recently and it is doing wonders it contains vitamin C collagen peptides there I am daydreaming it tastes really good it's tangerine flavor I will list everything down below in the description oops <laughs> Next up we have Clinique Smart Serum which is actually really great. I love this product. It helps repair my skin. Farsali, who doesn't love this product? Full of hydration. Should I start with the face or should I do eyes first? I think I'll do face. Yeah. Okay, let's do this. So I've got my foundation brush. And I'm just going to take this fan product. So I'm going to be priming my face with this primer all over. This is a great makeup base. I will list down all the products that I'm using today down in the description box. You're going to take your time and blend that stuff in to your skin gives you a flawless finish next stop is concealer I'm gonna conceal the under eyes and I'm going in with a brighter color that's twice as bright as my skin and I'm highlighting all the high points of my face because I really want it to have a very contoured look next stop is contouring I'm taking an angled brush and a very dark dark powder you can use cream concealer or cream contour as well but I'm gonna use powder and I'm going right above my cheekbones and a little bit inside of my nose just to give it a snatched look when you contour right above your cheeks it gives you a more defined face and now I'm doing the main part the jawline as you can see, I went a little above my natural jawline just so I can have a very contoured jawline. So this is what it looks like. And then I'm going to blend it all in with my foundation shade. Trust me, this process is going to make your foundation look even more flawless. This is the baking part. And since I'm doing a smoky eye look, I'm really going to go in with the baking powder under the eye. I'm going to let it bake all the while I do my eyes. This is a kahal. This is so easy, you guys, the smoky eyes. Don't be intimidated. Just go in and draw out lines on your eye doesn't have to be perfect eyeliner that's a little winged out and you just go in and draw it all in it's like a cat line then I'm gonna be smudging it all in as you can see I'm just really smudging it and pulling it towards the inside of my eye and this is gonna look good on any eye shape even if you have hooded eyes, just make sure you go above your hood. I'm using my first color, which is a very dark matte black. All I'm going to do is going to be stacking up the color on top of that kahal. Just to give it more intensity. And now I'm pulling it in again and smudging it all out. This is how easy it is. Pull it inwards second color I'm using this kind of goldish silverish shade 
from the palette and I'm just stacking it all with a flat brush piling it all the while you should be blending the two colors together over here concentrate on blending that line out mm -hmm. now I'm doing the bottom of my eyes with the same black I'm going really close to the lash line as you can see the liner really didn't have to be perfect because you smudge it all in it's looking good next stop I'm gonna be using this nude matte lipstick to do the inner corner of my eye oh yes we're gonna be using loose powder today which is glitter sparkly sparkly glitter and I'm gonna use this pointed brush to do the magic going in in the inner corner really close and I'm gonna be sticking on the glitter this way this is a little trick I always use for loose glitter you don't need glue or anything else and this really works all you gotta do is work really quickly so it doesn't dry out and voila you've got bling in the eye matte liquid lipsticks always help in sticking loose powder glitter like this because when it dries out it just sticks anywhere you put it on and it's all safe to do because obviously you wear the lipstick on your lips I'm using a kahel to line the bottom and the top you wanted that intense black mascara on make sure you get the inner corner of your lashes brows I'm just using a brown mascara to stick all the brows up last bit for the eye I'm going in with an angled brush with a light eyeshadow just at the tip of my brow going to just blend everything in and here you have it that was so easy <laughs> I'm up to no good on to the lips I'm going in with a deep red lip liner to line the natural line of my lips Mm -hmm. <laughs> then I'm going in with my favorite MAC lip shade in red which is Ruby Woo and I just like to swab instead of swipe because it gives it more of a natural look I'm gonna finish off with a little bit of more contouring brush off all the powder that I baked with and just kind of blend everything in this is the finale you guys you can go ahead and use your blush I went in with a nice pink shade of course highlight I like to highlight my nose with a precise brush just so I can give it a snatched look because when you use a fan brush it's just going to spread out your highlight here you have it voila it's looking pretty good you guys and it was so easy I hope you guys try out this look and if you do let me know tag me on Instagram leave me a comment down below I really love doing this tutorial I hope you guys enjoy it and don't forget to subscribe for more okay bye years.